Mind rockers, are you ready? She said she is not coming out till she goes deaf. So. National award winning actress, a most popular tweeter, and soon to be international pop star, a very own Desi Girl. Thing. The last time I think I was here, not one person shouted. I won my national award and I think everybody was very scared of the president, so nobody spoke. So this time, thank you so much for such an incredible <laughs> So, um, since you guys are here to hear me talk about my life, blah, 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 um, and I'm done. And uh, are you interested in hearing me speak? about my life, which I have never really done before. The truth or the fictitious lies? Are you ready for the truth? <laughs> Alright then, why don't we have a seat? This is going to be a long one. <laughs> called here to talk about perfection, perfect Priyanka, a perfect life, um, a perfect me. Uh, hi Masaba, I'm wearing a Masaba today, by the way, a huge shout out to Masaba for dressing me. So I was called here today to speak about my perfect life being, you know, the perfect Priyanka, being an actress, being in Bollywood and how all of you maybe and uh, a lot of other people that must be thinking how my life is absolutely perfect and you know what? It probably is. My life has been a little bit of a fairy tale. You guys want to sit down? No? Then you won't take me seriously, man. <laughs> Promise? Okay, because I'm, I'm like feeling very inspired to inspire you all today because you've inspired me. But I'll talk about it. Um, when we talk about perfection, what does it mean to each and every one of us? You know, we are young people today talking about how we want to be perfect in so many different ways. So the ideal definition of perfect... Right, Priyanka. That's what I'm here to tell you. That it is. I'm perfect. Hey. <laughs> and that each and every one of you can be. You know, when I started off, I was... Um, my parents in the army. When uh, all the army brats... Why are all the army brats that side? None of them here? 
There we go. ये कोई स्पीच वीच होने वाला नहीं है यहाँ पे गाने वाने बजाते हैं थोड़ा डांस वांस करते हैं घर जाते हैं और तो कुछ बातें होने वाली नहीं है माइंड सेल गोड क्वेश्चन आराम से um thank you i love you all too i really do you will on the 13th not today <laughs> okay everyone if you're not going to settle down i'm going to take her away and i mean it i mean business i want you all seated in one minute i mean it all you guys on this right side move yeah, it move man in the green t-shirt showing me his tongue you too i saw you principal boli principal Move it, move it! Come on! Fight, 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 fight! Sit, 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 sit! And let her talk, please. You can stare at her. You can take pictures. She's here, but let her say her piece. Right back at you. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Where are you? Thank you. Thank you very much. Okay, okay. I'm going to give you time for all of you to say all of this. Okay, just let us speak, and then I'll say ten minutes. Everyone say lovely things to Priyanka. Okay, you can I'll scream, you what. shout, everything. Thank you. Before she starts yelling at me, also, I'll give a short snap. <laughs> Not yet. Wait for a little while longer. <laughs> all right, all right. If we have settled down, I shall tell you the biography of my life, which you shall know very well, very soon. Should I? Oh my God, so much silence. Yeah. All right, all right, all right. Let's just get down to business. So when I was coming here, I was told that there are going to be a lot of young college students a lot of young people over here who i have to talk about my life to and um, my life to me has been an epitome of imperfection actually when it started out right in the beginning um everything about me for me was um chances was being scared was being fearful when i was a kid like i said i was an army army kid we moved around every two years somewhere moving every 2 years gave me an opportunity to start all over har do saal jaate hain different school um if i got bad results in the uh, next earlier school i would do better in the next school if i didn't have friends if i was naughty if i was punished you could always start all over again so my life somewhere has been sort of nomadic almost and um why i said imperfections i was i was a gawky kid I was a kid full of fear, insecurities. Um somebody who had very low self-esteem, didn't believe in myself at all. The only thing that I knew that I had was the ability to work bloody damn hard. And that's the only thing that I did. When I moved around from school to school, my dad, my mom making new friends, um the only thing that I knew consistently was I didn't know who I was and that's fine. you know we always strive to try and look for who am i who am i going to be who am i wanting to be should i be what my friends expect me to be or you know i'm not wearing the newest shoes i had a backpack in school which being from the army i mean you come from modest backgrounds and everything but um i had a backpack which i got re- repaired for almost 3 years before i could buy a new one not that my parents were of modest upbringing but because i somewhere said you know what is backpack se kya farak padta hai main to bandi hu backpack pehne se cool thodi na ho jaungi so it is about overcoming those little things that i did when i was 13 years old i went on a holiday to america for the first time pehli baar you know i went to a beauty parlor main um mummy ke sath gayi thi ki main apne baal baal katwaungi you know i'm going to america it's a big deal from bareilly to boston my first journey the last posting that my parents had was in bareilly and from there i suddenly went to boston when i went to school for the first time india mein na main i was a very uh, intelligent kid when i was in school you know how we become teachers pets if you're the first one to give the answer 
teacher asks the question, you say, ma'am, 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 me, 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 I want to answer. And you're the pet. When I went to America, I said, ulta hua. Every time I raised my hands, all the kids looked at me like, Ki kya hai? You know, you're cooler if you don't know the answers. You're cooler if you're not smart. Which was a logic I never understood. But I started hiding my being intelligent in 9th standard when I reached there. Um, I stopped answering the questions. Abhi grades to lani thi nahi, meri maasi mujhe daakti. It was actually a holiday that I went for. I went to school, I went to see my cousin's school. Um, it was very cool, you know, big schools with lockers and all. You watch it in, you know, English movies. You have lockers with those uh, combination locks and you have all these students who are trying to be. And I was a scared, gawky 12-year-old, you know, stepping into my teens. I didn't know what I was doing. For the first two months of being in, in school, and have you, have you, any of you watched these American high school movies? High school is exactly like that. It is peer pressure, scary, popular kids, unpopular kids, nerds, geeks, all of that. So, I didn't understand that funda at all. For the first two months, I didn't know that I had to eat food in the cafeteria. And as soon as I used to look down, staircase was there. And I used to look down in the cafeteria, you know, you, everybody had a seat. Because they came from middle school to high school themselves. So everybody had their seats, you know, the cool kids hung out together, the sporty kids hung out together, um, the geeky kids hung out together. Or I didn't know where I should go. So I used to take my lunch money, buy vending machines, say, I used to buy um, chips and sit in the bathroom and eat so that people didn't know that I didn't go to the cafeteria. So people didn't think that um, I didn't know how to stand in that line and take food from the cafeteria. Slowly, of course, I overcame that. One girl saw me doing that in the cafeteria and became my friend. She took me to the cafe, um, found a place for me to sit. The first time I had walked in with that tray and they put mashed potatoes for me. I thought it was vanilla ice cream. And I said, this so vanilla ice cream kharab ho gaya. And she looked at me like, uh, it's mashed potatoes. And I was like, oh, I didn't know what mashed potatoes was. All this American funda took me a little while. Ninth standard, 10th standard. By then I started sort of started coming into my own. I became relatively popular because I started taking part in I didn't know what I like doing. I didn't know that um, do I like singing, do I like what kind of extracurriculars and you have to take extracurriculars. So I didn't understand that. I took everything. I did ballet for one semester. I did. I played the drums for one semester. I did um, Broadway for one semester. I did uh, dancing for a semester. I didn't know what all I was doing besides studying. So I became an honor roll student. Um, I did almost every possible extracurricular that I could, trying to find who I was. In the meantime, there was this one thing which you'll find very interesting, that I uh, had a lot of uh, racist issues happening with me. I used to walk past and this cluster of girls, for what reason they hated me, I don't know. But they started calling me Brownie. They started calling me um, all these strange names. And you know when you're 12 or 13, when you're typecasted and stereotyped, and I'm sure a lot of us may have gone through it at different phases in life, where you're typecast, ki, ye to aisi hai, yare, ye to waisa hai, isko kuch pata nahi. But when it came down to my culture and being pointed a finger at because I was Indian, because, and I'm not saying all of America is like that, my high school experience for a little while was like that. So they started calling me all these names. So once, I had a fight. And a proper mukka mari wali, like proper fight. Because this girl started insinuating rubbish things to me. And um, she said, ki, thik hai, thik hai, you know what, I'll meet you in a basketball court. And she became all like, you know, like a wrestler type to me. So I was scared, but now, you know, ego is coming to you sometimes. And Delhi wale, you know what ego means, right? <laughs> Punjabi shan had to be protected. <laughs> So I walked out on that basketball court with three, four of my friends and there were about 25 of these girls standing there. And basketball court, I didn't get I still have, you know, scars from that fight. So she jumped onto me, we fought, we fought. Um, counselor came, a lot of people were fight, 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 cat fight, ye wo. I broke her nose and she scratched my face. And then I was suspended for three days. <laughs> not something to be, not something to be proud of. Not something to be proud of. But my mom came to visit me. I was in 11th standard, and I said, "Yar, I'm tired." 
I, I don't know if I can, I can fight this anymore. Maybe I have not understood what I am. And, and I did really well in school. You know, I was one year away from graduating and I told my mom, I just want to go back. And uh, my experience in America was an incredible experience. It taught me so much. It taught me about music. It taught me self-confidence. It taught me uh, about life in general. But it took away a little bit of my confidence from me for being Indian, for being brownie for being brown and saying, you know what, I can also conquer the world. And I told my mom, ki, you know, my heart is not I want to come back to India. My parents were in Bareilly that time. So from Boston back to Bareilly. Next journey. I came back to Bareilly for 12th standard. Abhi yaha aake science student, I wanted to be an aeronautical engineer. Achha, in my entire life, every year I wanted to be something else. Every year. So one time I wanted to be a dancer. When I was four years old, I went to a fancy dress show mein dulhan ban ke ke thi because I found it very fascinating that you know, to go to the top of the head and go like So my ambition in life was to be a dulhan boy. This one was for you, by the way. Anybody noticing? Okay. Um, the next day... The most loud sound is coming from there. Maybe the girls are sitting there in Delhi. <laughs> Sorry, sorry, ignore kya aapko. I'm sorry, no offense. <laughs> I wanted to be a dulhan. I wanted to be, um, one interesting thing that I became in my fancy dress show was I wanted to be a bhindi. Yes, very embarrassing moment of my life, but I dressed up as a bhindi and I went to school. So hence you can tell my ambitions were very varied. I couldn't make up my mind about what I liked, what I wanted to do. So by the time I came back to school, I figured ki, I am a math student, I am a math student, physics I am a math I want to be an engineer. I want to be an aeronautical engineer because I love the idea of flying. It's the only thing that I think made me and all of us feel free. I am a good person. So I studied really hard. India came back and the syllabus blew my mind. I am an honor roll student, 4.0 GPA, this, that, 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 that. Trigonometry, calculus, physics, chemistry, I lost my mind. I was only doing tuitions, tuitions, tuitions. I forgot who I was. Remember, you know, I was take, I was going to school, coming for maths tuition, physics tuition, Hindi tuition, ye tuition, wo tuition. Raat ko char ghante soti thi, boards ke exam. I, you know, for a while I started thinking it would have been better if I was there only. Ek saal ki baat thi, ek aur do naat tor de thi maybe. And I would have been fine, I would have graduated, you know. But I came back. So my poor mother sort of felt bad for me. Um, our house was Femina magazine aati thi. and uh, you know they have that Miss India contest ka form every year and just for fun, I was 17 years old that time, just for fun my brother decided to tell my mom who was 10 years old, na? our Chopra family is thinking a lot of further. So who was 10 years old told mom that mom, look, your mother is long, she looks a bit like that. Um, it's okay na, if she goes for Miss India, what is there? So my mother just as a joke, humne wo, you know, soft focus, um, wo photo studios hote na? Usme I had taken photographs for a scholarship program in Australia, which I wanted to apply for. Soft focus, aise aise karke, poses jo lene hote hain, like that. All of these, appreciate you, jay, zara. Zara tawajjo diya jai, thank you very much. <laughs> so, wo photographs Miss India ke liye bheje gai. I don't know who was the judge who decided that this girl is good, she looks beautiful, 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 she yes mom, this is my dream in life. I want to be Miss India, please, mujhe yaan se le jau. Mere dad ne bola, achha, satra saal ki mein, who's going to bell the cat, who's going to tell the father ki bhaiya, free boards chhodke, she wants to be Miss India, go to Delhi. Anyway, my mother one day decided champagne, ghar ka khana, thoda sa pamper kiya, and daddy pisle. <laughs> and dad ne bula, okay, okay, go for five days. Um, chutti bhi ho jayegi, wapis a jana, uske baad padhai kar lenge. Alright, I went for five days. I got selected for Miss India. Okay, ten more days. Went to Bombay. About fifteen days ka pageant tha. I won that. Abhi, zindagi mein kisi ne socha bhi nahi hoga ki... एक महीने पहले मैं आमी स्कूल के स्कूल यूनिफॉर्म में थी um, वो बाता के शूज पहन के सॉक्स से डर था यू नो ट्यूनिक विद द बेल्ट टाई हाउस कैप्टन अभी सडनली मैं हील्स में हूँ साड़ीज में हूँ 
और जजेस जो मेरे बहुत बेहतरीन जजेस थे उनके सामने अच्छा मेरा क्वेश्चन का क्वेश्चन क्या था मिस इंडिया का एट सेवनटीन है हाउ मेनी ऑफ यू आर सेवनटीन फोर ऑफ यू ओके 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 वो देर ओके सो द थिंक अबाउट दिस इफ यू ऊपर 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 तो कैसे मैं नहीं देख सकती ऊपर तो मैं ऊपर ही स्पीच देने आई नीचे तो कोई है नहीं द क्वेश्चन दैट आई वॉज आज टू मी एट मिस इंडिया वॉज इफ इग्नोरेंस इज ब्लिस देन वाई डू वी सीक नॉलेज सेवनटीन ईयर्स ओल्ड आज मुझे वो जज मिल जाए ना बट सम हाउ आई रैप माई वे अराउंड इट कि हाँ हाँ इग्नोरेंस नहीं होता तो अगर अगर नॉलेज नहीं होता तो आई वुड नॉट हैव नोन अबाउट लव केयरिंग एंड शेयरिंग एंड समथिंग आई डोट नो वेदर केम फ्रॉम आई वॉन्ट मिस इंडिया सेवनटीन ईयर्स ओल्ड एंड सडनली आई रियलाइज कि भाई अभी एग्जाम्स का क्या होगा <laughs> पढ़ाई कैसे होगी एनी anyway, वो सब हुआ चार महीने बाद आई हैव गो फॉर मिस वर्ल्ड इट इज मैंडेटरी दैट यू हैव टू गो फॉर मिस वर्ल्ड एट सेवनटीन द मिलेनियम ईयर टू थाउजेंड आई वॉज सेंट टू लंडन शिफ्ट ऑफ टू बी पार्टिसिपेटिंग इन मिस वर्ल्ड इन द मिस वर्ल्ड पैजेंट विच हैड विनर्स फ्रॉम नाइंटी सिक्स कंट्रीज एंड दीज आर स्टनिंग ब्यूटिफुल मॉडल लाइक गर्ल्स मतलब दे वर सम थ्री हंड्रेड फीट टॉल एंड गजल लाइक ब्यूटिफुल हेयर लाइक आईज I reached the airport. My mother was with me, poor thing. I looked at her and I said, "Ugly flight me, back is jana chahiye." Very bad idea for my confidence. Very bad idea for my upbringing. Kaisi ma ho? Yaha pe liye mujhe. And my mother said, "Acha bhi aa gaye hain. Desh ka sawal hai. Just do your best. After that, you go back to school. What is there?" So I said, "All right." Ye soch ke I went for Miss World. Karte karte karte. By the time two days, three days came close. I was one of the highest rated to win Miss World. You know they have those polls and and all of those things. And I started thinking that our India's population is so much that more people have voted. You know, voting was done. That that is the one thing that we know how to do very well: procreate. And uh, voting happened. The day I won Miss World, my life changed. I was not 17 anymore. I suddenly grew up. I suddenly. was in the middle of world media the next morning at 17 still talking about the economy of uganda <laughs> and my opinion on it how <laughs> how african children <laughs> should be um, taken care of and i said bhai hamare indian children ka kya ho <laughs> Anyway, Miss World happened. I grew up. I stepped up, and I said, "Ki I have to be the ambassador of the country." Every time I met girls who were my school uh, classmates, when I came back to India, suddenly they were taking my autograph. Suddenly they were becoming my fans and talking about, "Priyanka, we look up to you." Arey, abhi to mere class mein thi tum. And right now they used to say, "Ki oh, you know, you are not getting this um, physics ka problem. To me to kuch nahi aata." And looking down upon me, and suddenly I was an idol. because i knew the answer to the economy of uganda so <laughs> but life changed i grew up and uh, i didn't know where i was going after that i was confused uh, i didn't know if i should go back to study i didn't know if i should uh, do anything i didn't know what to do one year i traveled like a nomad wherever miss world took me as the ambassador of the country as a goodwill ambassador to the world and uh, my mother told me ki are bhai ab padhai kaun karega First question after I won Miss World. Who's going to study? Oh, you have won! Congratulations! What is going to happen? Very supportive parents. <laughs> um, after that, I went back to college. I joined Jaihim College after I became Miss World because I was very academically driven. I wanted to study. Um, I went back to college, but it didn't happen. क्लास में नहीं बैठने देते थे मुझे बिकॉज एवरीबडी वॉज लाइक मिस वर्ल्ड ये वो तो थोड़ा हवा बच गया था मेरा इट वॉज एन वर्किंग आउट बींग साइंस स्टूडेंट एंड गोइंग टू अ कॉलेज वेर नो बडी वॉज एक्चुअली माई क्लासमेट बट एवरीबडी लुक एट मी लाइक अरे भाई कौन आ गया मूवीज स्टार्टेड हैपनिंग टू मी 
मान ही आता था मूवीज का मुझे मतलब ऑल आई हैव डन व्हेन यू लिव इन अ स्मॉल टाउन एंड यू गाइस आर फ्रॉम दिल्ली आई डोंट नो इफ यू विल अंडरस्टैंड द फीलिंग ऑफ दिस बट व्हेन यू आर फ्रॉम अ स्मॉल टाउन शाउट आउट माय गॉड आई एम स्कूल वाओ सिमारिया आल्सो वाज माय स्कूल Well done, small town power. <laughs> Are that doesn't mean we don't like Delhi. I've lived in Bombay for 10 years now. Big town power. So movies happened. Um I told my mom, I said uh, movies. She said acting. I said wo bhi ho jayegi. Ye ho gaya to ho jayegi. She said, "Look, there's only one thing she told me." She said whatever you do know that it was your decision do you have the courage of conviction to say that today i'm getting out of college today i'm going to join a film tomorrow when people throw stones at me and then say i'm i don't know how to act or say that i'm not good enough will you be able to deal with it so i told her i don't know but i'm willing to try i want to give it a shot and i did मेरी पहली फिल्म में मेरी एंट्री इंटरवल के बाद होती है और मैं क्लाइमैक्स से पहले मर जाती हूं हीरो 2003 उसके बाद अंदाज आए अगेन एंट्री इंटरवल के बाद आती है लेकिन इस बार क्लाइमैक्स तक थी मैं हीरो नहीं मिलता मुझे लेकिन बट आई वॉन्ट ऑल द डेब्यू अवार्ड दैट यूर आई डेंट नो हाउ टू एक्ट द ओनली थिंग आई न्यू वॉज आई कैन लर्न आई लर्न हाउ टू सर्वाइव इन एन अमेरिकन हाई स्कूल आई लर्न हाउ टू बी मिस इंडिया when i didn't know anything i didn't even know how to walk in heels or wear a sari i learned to represent my country at miss world i will learn to act wo ek cheez mujhe aati hai so when i won uh, my first debut award uh, i looked at it and i said are to mujhe acting aati hogi <laughs> let's give this a shot But you know the thing is I have always which is something I'll tell all of you life can never be safe and if it's safe it's not worth living it really isn't Thank you I'll wait for the applause I didn't know what to do in movies I didn't have a godfather I didn't have somebody giving me advice and telling me ki acha ye film tumhare liye achhi hai ye film buri hai my parents poor thing were doctors they didn't know anything nobody to tell me or recommend me in a film bahut sari aisi filmein thi from which i was thrown out because somebody's somebody was recommended because the hero likes this heroine so i'm sorry priyanka you can't be cast in the film i never had that i never had anybody saying you know why don't we cast priyanka chopra in this movie because um, yaar yeah, mujhe pasand hai i never had that all i had was dedication hard work and trying to prove ki agar maine chance liya hai to be a part of films maybe i can do a little bit more and i started taking risks i didn't know it at that point but now at hindsight if i look at it my career has always been instinctive if you've watched my films you'll know the second year of movies for me i did a film called etras everyone told me when i did that film ki तुम्हें हीरोइन बनना है इफ यू डू दिस फिल्म तुम वैम्प बन के रह जाओ दैट्स ऑल यूल बी यूल बी अ वैम्प यू विल नो बडी विल कास्ट यूज अ हीरोइन यूल ऑलवेज बी यू नो लाइक वन ऑफ दोज गर्ल्स हु कम्स एंड ट्राइज टू टेक अवे द हीरोइन बट समथिंग इन माई हार्ट टोल्ड मी दैट फिल्म वॉज एन इंटरेस्टिंग मूवी आई डिड इट आई वॉन्ट ऑल द अवार्ड दैट यर फॉर द नेगेटिव कैरेक्टर एंड इट वॉज माई सेकेंड ईयर इन फिल्म then i did a film called fashion fashion when i did thank you thank you i was 3 years into films around that time only about 3 years everybody told me ki female oriented picture koi nahi dekha heroine karti hai female oriented films when their careers are over you know when they are about to get married or they don't have a career anymore why are you doing it so early i just knew i believed in it i just knew madhur and i sat down mujhe scripting writing bare mein kuch nahi pata tha mujhe bas pata tha ki kahani mujhe sunni aati hai main kahani batana mujhe pata hai 
So I sat with him. I told him I like the script. ऐसे करना चाहिए मेघना ऐसी होगी. And somewhere she was a small town girl, so I related to her. I stood on this stage and won a national award for that film. When everybody told me I couldn't do it. Then I did a lot of other films I took chances in. They didn't do well. Some of them don't do well. Some of them do well. I did What's Your Rashi? None of you liked it. Nobody went and saw it. But we all liked it. <laughs> But it was a big, it was a big chance for an actress. Bara roles. Today I'm in the world. I'm, I'm, I have some world record for the only actress who has ever played twelve different parts. Thank you. I appreciate that. It was a special film. For me. I did that film, and alongside of that, I did the Dostana, I did Dawn, I did Fresh. Thank you. I did all of those films also, which I believed in. Huh? I'm coming to that, dear. वो तो पिछले साल थी. रुक जाना. So I did all of those um, safe blockbuster, hundred crore spinning movies also because. those are the films we enjoy watching but taking a chance is so much fun sometimes kabhi kabhi galat padta hai kabhi kabhi sahi padta hai but it just it makes you feel alive yeah what your rashi didn't do well but what the hell man i did something different it's very easy for me today to do five songs 20 scenes you know be pretty wear the best clothes designer outfits and have a 100 crore movie that's not how i want my life to be i don't want my life to be one of the many i want to be different and it's okay to be different when we talk about perfection perfection is accepting who you are and being okay with it i never thought growing up or even today that i'm the best looking girl in the world i'm not i'm not ashwari rai bachchan perfect stunning i'm not thank you That's because you all love me now, to bro. <laughs> But in the beginning, when I joined films, I was not conventional. People used to say, "Arey, she's too dusky. She's too dark to be a heroine." People used to say, "You know, she doesn't have the perfect features." People. Um, but all I did throughout this whole thing was smile through it, because somebody told me my smile is nice. Now they say it's plastic surgery, but uh, <laughs> abhi tak same smile raha hai. And the reason why people say I have a nice smile is because it comes into my eyes, and it comes into my eyes with the knowledge of knowing that I am who I am, and I'm okay with it. I'm okay with making mistakes. <laughs> Taking chances makes you feel alive. and no matter what anybody turns around and tells you ki yaar ye nahi hoga agar dil mein aata hai na to kar do if you don't do it in your youth when are you going to do it when you're bloody 50 no offense to people who are 50 ladies and gentlemen because at 50 also you can do it it's still the chapter ho yaar panga pad jayega front row pe <laughs> Now I'm at a point in my life over the last 2-3 years where I have become comfortable with who I am. Abhi tak main dhoond rahi thi ki bhai who am I? What do I like doing? What do I want to do? Who do I want to be? Do I want to be like Kajol? Do I want to be like Madhuri? Do I want to be like Shri Devi? In the last 3 years I've realized that Priyanka is okay. Priyanka is fine and I actually want to be her. and it's good being you you know you'll have a sense of freedom a sense of liberation a rocket that will make you fly at your feet which will make you feel like you know i want to reach the highest of highs and when you have that drive in you you can be whoever the hell you want today when i did dawn 2 or when i did agni path and they did 100 crores and they were the 100 crore club every journalist asked me how does it feel to be a part of the 100 crore club it feels great it feels great that my films did do did that well but they weren't because of me it was shahrukh khan and hrithik roshan in those films i was a part of it i accept that thank you
आई एक्सेप्ट दैट मैंने भी थोड़ी फाइटिंग वाइटिंग की मैं भी जंगली बिल्ली बनी मैंने भी थोड़े गाने वाला गाने मैंने भी थोड़ा एड किया um so i'm very proud of those films but today i have the courage and i would take pride in that to do a film like barfi barfi is releasing on 14 september but i wanted to do this film and i didn't want to do it ye soch ke ki acha i'm playing an autistic girl half of india doesn't even know what autism is all they say is ha pagal play kar rahi hai film mein she's she's mad in the movie but nobody knew what it is even i didn't know what it is i saw my name is khan usme dekha tha maine ki he had asperger syndrome but that's not what autism is today i have the courage to play that role in a commercial film and ranbir kapoor who is one of the youngest icons today we have has the courage to play a deaf and mute character in a mainstream film today actors can do that because we are willing to take that chance and you can only take that chance when you believe that it's okay to be you so being you is what will give you empower you to not be perfect and it's all right to not be perfect i don't want to be perfect i didn't hear that <laughs> are you want me to finish <laughs> is that a hint <laughs> thank you thank you but coming down to um, what i really was here to say um i'm embarking on again a new journey mujhe nahi pata yaar chalega nahi chalega will i do well will i not do well will it be right will you like barfi will you like what i tried to do or not all i know is alongside of barfi i'm starting on another new journey i have decided i want to be a singer i didn't leave. अच्छा बाय द वे लेडीज एंड जेंटलमैन बॉयज एंड गर्ल्स इनका दिन का मैंने नहीं गाया है जस्ट फॉर योर इन्फॉर्मेशन अलीशा चिनोय ने गाया जिनकी आवाज मेरी तरह है <laughs> वो भी नहीं गाया मैंने अभी तक हैव एन सॉन्ग एनी एनी सॉन्ग आई कैन हियर यू ऑल सॉरी आई कैन हियर मैं बर्फी बन गई मुझे कुछ सुनाई नहीं दे रहा बोलना नहीं माय टॉपिक वाज मूवीज म्यूजिक एंड लाइफ वेल टू टेल यू यू विल हियर माय म्यूजिक ऑन थर्टीन ऑफ सितंबर विथ बर्फी कहते हैं ना कि हर अच्छी चीज वेट करने से मिलती है अगली बार मुझे इंडिया टुडे वाले कैसे बुलाएंगे इफ आई सिंग फू राइट ना आई गिव दम समथिंग फॉर नेक्स्ट ईयर प्रीव्यू प्रीव्यू टीजर टीजर लेट यू आई वॉन्ट यू ऑल टू कम टू मी विद द ऑनेस्ट ट्रूथ हाउ मेनी ऑफ यू ऑल ऑन ट्विटर That's a lot of people, but all of you can write to me and tell me you sucked or you rocked or we loved it. अरे सुन तो लो यार. गाना तो सुन लेना पहले फिर बोल देना. Such unbiased love, I tell you. ऐसा relationships में होता तो ज़िंदगी कितनी दूर होती ना. Okay, 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 okay. At the end of my speech, then I won't sing. A deal is a deal. You all want me to sing? I'll sing two lines at the end of my speech. Done? Before we do Q and A, promise? Zada mat bada, deal is a deal. Two lines. Don't jump the gun. <laughs> Not in my city. that you'll have to hear on the 13th uske baad whenever we meet i'll sing to you so talking about my music um it was uh, a risk a chance no one in india has ever done it uh, it's i i'm signed with um the globe's biggest music company um which is universal which is interscope and i have worked and written this album which i never knew i could do mujhe nahi pata tha mujhe gaane likhne aate hain i didn't know even i could sing 
वो भी पिछले डेढ़ साल की डेवलपमेंट है बट इंडिया एज अ नेशन ओके इफ यू थिंक हाउ मेनी वी लिसन टू इंग्लिश म्यूजिक वी ऑल डू ओके सो इफ यू थिंक अबाउट ग्लोबल पॉप म्यूजिक इफ यू थिंक अबाउट टॉप टेन बिल बोर्ड चार्ट देर इज शकीरा देर इज रियाना देर इज डेविड गैरा देर इज स्वीडिश हाउस माफिया नन ऑफ दीज पीपल आर फ्रॉम द यूनाइटेड स्टेट्स यू हैव साउथ अमेरिका बींग रेप्रेजेंटेड बाय शकीरा यू हैव लैटिन अमेरिका बींग रेप्रेजेंटेड बाय जेलो यू हैव यूरोप बींग रेप्रेजेंटेड बाय स्वीडिश हाउस माफिया डेविड गैरा हाउ डज इंडिया नॉट हैव रेप्रेजेंटेशन लुक मैम आई एम नॉट सेंग कि मैं अगली पॉप आइकॉन होने वाली हूं लेकिन होना चाहिए ना हमारे साथ भी ऐसा सो दैट वॉज द आइडिया दैट यूनिवर्सल केम टू मी विथ दैट वाई इज देर नॉट एन इंडियन पॉप आइकॉन बिकॉज वी एज अ नेशन आर सो म्यूजिकल अरे हमारे बारातों पर म्यूजिक होता है हमारे बर्थडेज पर म्यूजिक होता है अभी यहां पर भी म्यूजिक है लोग देख लो doesn't matter if i'm trying to give a serious speech no one's interested as long as we have music it's all good so india should have that kind of representation so i said are but i don't know if i can sing i don't know if i can do this and what the hell let's give it a shot sab kuch to aise kiya life mein did it and today my and i i'm very proud of it and i'm proud of it not just because it's my song but i'm proud of it as an for my nation because it's never happened before my song is called in my city it's dedicated to because i'm an army brat is dedicated to all the cities where i grew up um it says welcome to my city and uh, it is going to be the theme song for nfl this year nfl being national football league and abhi tak to debut bhi nahi hua gaane ka and it already is so it's it, it's 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 encouraging and it's it's shocking and i'm scared i'm nervous it's like giving an exam barfi aur ye gana dono saath mein aayenge i don't know which one people will like which one they won't will they will they not all these questions i hope so <laughs> i hope so but the point being that music movies life everything for me has been completely wholly and solely inspired from one thing which is something inside of me my conscience that tells me that no matter what i do i will not lose my respect doing it i will not lose my dignity as a woman doing it i'm very close to my father i'm sure all you guys are but i'm i'm i am daddy's little girl my new tattoo only tattoo um it's my dad's handwriting so i got him to write it and then i tattooed it so i have a part of him with me always but um i think my dad has al- always inspired me in some way music sunte bade hue hain and always inspired me to sort of be whoever i am and the only thing he told me ki you know beta whatever you do you should be able to come home and look into my eyes and know that you're okay still being called my daughter i'm not a chopra today because I am a Chopra. I am a Chopra because my father was a Chopra. I am a Chopra because his father was a Chopra. I carry a legacy of Chopras. Yes, I may not be a Bollywood blue-blooded family, but I am. अभी बनाने की कोशिश कर रही हूँ मैं बाद में. मैं अपने सारे cousins को घुसा रही हूँ धीरे-धीरे फिल्मों में. But <laughs> right, I'm trying. Sorry, sorry. Wait, wait. There are more to come. <laughs> I'll be the next legacy. But it's important to remember when you go back home and you go to sleep at night. सुकून की नींद आनी चाहिए कि आज मैंने कुछ गलत नहीं किया गलत लोग सोचें गलत है लेकिन एज लॉन्ग एज इट वॉज योर डिसीजन एंड यू कैन लिव विद इट इवन इफ इट्स रॉन्ग इवन इफ एवरीबडी अराउंड यू टेल यू वॉट आर यू डूइंग आर यू मैड इफ यू कैन स्लीप विद इट एंड यू नो इट कम्स फ्रॉम अ प्योर प्लेस इट्स ऑल राइट इट्स फ्लॉलेस इट्स ऑल राइट इवन इफ इट्स फ्लॉल फ्लॉड being graceful and dignified is what being perfect priyanka is about i'm flawed but i'm graceful about it i like my flaws yeah i'm okay being a little flawed so coming to the conclusion of my point tonight ladies and gentlemen be yourselves guys it's great 
to be you. As soon as we decide कि अरे मुझे इसके कपड़े अच्छे लगते हैं you know I want to be like her, we forget who we are. We forget who we ever wanted to be. As soon as you realize कि you know what मुझे तो दाल अच्छी लगती है मैं को चिकन नहीं खाना Not because everybody is eating chicken around you is the right thing to do, but मुझे वेजिटेरियन बनना है Not that I'm vegetarian. Sorry, no offense to all vegetarians. Just a metaphor. But it's okay to be different. It's all right to not fit in. I've not fit in anywhere. I never fitted in anywhere. Today, even as an actress, I don't fit in. लोग मुझे कहते हैं हमने बर्फी जैसी फिल्म की अरे glamorous roles करने चाहिए अरे नहीं करने मुझे I do it. मैं कितनी glamorous लग रही हूँ तुम लोग इन मसाबा आउटफिट यू ऑल नो आई एम ग्लैमरस एनी वे बट इट डजेंट मैटर वेन इट कम्स टू माई वर्क इट कम्स टू माई हार्ट एंड दैट्स वर आई वॉन्ट टेल यू ऑल टू नाइट योर यंग पीपल द वर्ल्ड इज योर ऑइस्टर इफ आई अ गर्ल फ्रॉम अ स्मॉल टाउन लाइक बरेली फ्रॉम एन आर्मी ऑफिसर्स फैमिली मिडिल क्लास बैकग्राउंड कैन टूडे बी अ मूवी स्टार गिविंग एन इंस्पिरेशनल स्पीच टू यू टूडे बी डेब्यूइंग इन अमेरिका एज अ इंटरनेशनल पॉप स्टार can't any one of you do it if i can do it yeah. you can do it right the world is your oyster put your finger on it and you can be it that is what today's generation can do mere bhi hai the noise so that's all i'll say now <laughs> i think i've said enough all right all right, all right. Say bullies, oh yeah! Just because you're in numbers and I'm one. All right, two lines. Close your eyes, everybody. Me ko sharam aati. All right, all right. Just because you think I sang thin ka thin ka, I'll sing a couple of lines. Itni baatein karke awaz mere bed gaye, but just in case. All right? Don't look at me, yeah, guys. Look away, look away. <laughs> udhar udhar dekho. Sirf suno. All right, all right. जैसे भरा हर दिल में हर माते कौन हर दिल में हर माते कौन बस कोई समझे जरा Thank you very much for being so patient. Thank you very much for listening to me. Now I'll answer your questions. Now I also want to have some fun. Itna baat kar liya, itni badi speech liya, gana gana bhi ga liya. Now I want to be entertained by y'all asking me interesting questions. Please, dhise pe the sawal mat puchna. Try and be original. Try and be cool. Ask me fun questions. I will give the moderator a chance to talk. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Priyanka. I'm going to take the liberty of the first few questions. So, you know, it whatever you like. Okay. I've been made to stand. She didn't want to stand because I'm wearing very high heels. <laughs> I'm heels. standing on the sofa now. <laughs> Then I'll be the same height as her. I'm actually not so long. It's just my heels. That's why I didn't want to stand. Okay. So, Priyanka, you said um, you were a gawky teenager. Where, where where is that gawky teenager? When I take out my shoes, na, you see the gawk. <laughs> where where are the flaws? Um, when you grow up, you learn how to hide them. When I go back home, I'm as flawed as I can be, and it's okay to be flawed. Yes, it's okay to be flawed, and you said it's okay not to fit in, but you don't fit in. You stand out <laughs> in a good way. What about people who don't fit in but don't necessarily stand out? I didn't stand out. I used to sit in my cafeteria and eat lunch for many many months because I was scared that I won't stand out. I used to hide from people. I wouldn't talk to people. I was shy, I was gawky. I never thought I was pretty. I never thought I could be in front of people. I stand out today because I worked on myself. So if I can stand out today being that girl who used to sit behind a rickshaw and you know have uh, you know those whitish kind of legs Which you know, dry or jate, or frizzy hair in a dirty uniform. 
from that my leg sell almost uh, 12 brands today <laughs> So it comes from working on yourself. Any one of us can do it. Like I said, if I can do it, man, I'm a live example of the fact that any one of us can do it. So uh, I'm going to throw the floor open. Oh my God! You decide, Julia. Man in the purple T-shirt. Uh, hello, ma'am. You are gorgeous, and I love you. First, tell me your name. Uh, my name is Abhyudeh, and I am from Symbiosis, Noida. Hi. Uh, my question is. Uh, how is it? Uh, how is? Farra, uh, lekar aayo. Acha. I couldn't speak like this without writing. It's okay. It's okay. Mere paas bhi bade the class mein. How is it was? How is Guys, it? Guys, I can't hear him. How how is it was for you to carry the dual image of a desi girl and a sophisticated modern girl? Um, I think all of us have that today. Aaj ham log jeans pehn ke ghumte hain ya shorts pehn ke ghumte hain, lekin eventually ham log jab ghar jaate hain. लड़के का हाथ पकड़ के अपने पेरेंट्स के सामने तो नहीं जाएंगे या फिर जब बड़े कमरे के अंदर आते हैं वी स्टैंड अप दैट इज वॉर आर इंडियन आर ब्रिंगिंग टीचर्स अस एंड आई एम प्राउड टू बी दैट सो यू हैव टू ऑल ऑफ अस बैलेंस इट गर्ल इन द ब्लैक ड्रेस शी डिसाइड नो 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 कमिंग अप ऑन स्टेज सॉरी सॉरी यस नेक्स्ट आंसर एंड देन इफ शी अलाउज इट प्रिंसिपल मैडम बहुत स्ट्रिक्ट है जल्दी जल्दी माइक्स क्विक 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 हाय प्रियंका हाय नामिका एंड आई एम नामिका यस आई एम अ नेवल ऑफिसर डॉटर सो डिफेंस ब्रैट ओके दैट इन फैशन द गर्ल यू डिपिक्टेड इन फैशन डिड दैट एवर हैपन टू यू टू बीइंग अ यू नो स्टार नो नॉट एट ऑल एक्चुअली अम यू नो आई एम वेरी इंटिमिडेटिंग इफ आई डिसाइड टू से नो आई स्टिक बाय माय नो If somebody ever tries to put me in an uncomfortable position, actually ये बहुत बड़ा secret है जब भी आप लोग मुझे एक sexy dress में देखेंगे ना just understand and know that there's a black belt inside. And what do I mean by a black belt? Kung Fu fighting. <laughs> so nobody takes pangas with me. Um, no, I I was never scared of of saying no. I always believed, which my mom told me, nothing is do or die. अगर लाइफ में कुछ नहीं होता ना सपोज यू फेल योर एग्जाम्स और माई फिल्म डोंट डू वेल एंड आई मेड लॉट्स ऑफ मिस्टेक्स एंड हैड लॉट्स ऑफ फेलियर्स आई एम सिटिंग हियर टॉकिंग अबाउट माई सक्सेस इज बिकॉज टूडे आई एम सक्सेसफुल बट वेन आई वॉज इंट और इफ आई हैड अ फेलियर माई लास्ट फिल्म डिन डू वेल बट आई एम स्टिल हियर एंड टॉकिंग अबाउट दैट ऑल यू हैव टू रिमेंबर दैट इट्स नथिंग इज डू और आई पीपल कम एंड टेल मी इफ आई डोंट बिकम एन एक्ट्रेस आई डू एनी थिंग टू बिकम एन एक्ट्रेस वाई If you can't act, it's okay. Yeah, business कर लेंगे, कुछ और कर लेंगे. Tomorrow, today I've decided to be a musician. Tomorrow I might become a designer and learn from Masaba. Day after, I might suddenly decide that you know what, I want to be a doctor now or a politician. Who knows? Life is anything is possible. It's endless. Tomorrow is a new day with new beginnings and new possibilities. So, can you talk a little bit about what happened when something went wrong? How did you pick yourself up? You know, what allows you to be de-stress and what you're saying in your new movie be barfi how, it's, how do you it's do very that? important to allow yourself to feel bad if you fail at something for me when i was very young i read a quote somewhere which has been the definition of my life failure is not an option say it with me failure remember that somebody told me that failure is not an option maine wo quote kaat ke apne apne study table ke upar lagaya tha but whenever i fail which each and every one of us will you have to remember it's okay to cry it's okay to scream it's okay to go tell your parents i hate you right now i don't want to talk to you mujhe khana nahi khana hai mujhe ye nahi karna i do all of those things but that is what makes me want to get up and say you know what i'll give it another shot okay one question there to the vasant wali kid I'm Anish you. from uh, Vasantari School. Just hold the mic closer to you. I can't. Okay, hear. I'm Anish um, from Vasantari School. So I wanted to ask you: uh, Was it difficult for you coming from a protected environment? You know, going into the big bad world of Bollywood. <laughs> it was damn hard. But you know what? I was always in a protected environment. Just because my father was not an actor, and just because he was not famous, did not mean that he didn't have muscles, man. He was everywhere. My mom was everywhere. I was always protected, and they always told me, "Ki nahi hua na, koi baat nahi. Come back home, and it's fine." My mother went with me everywhere till almost three years ago. 
And sorry. Can I have your autograph? Please. Principal so ma'am. What, what happened to the other children? If your mother was traveling with you, weren't you like then the favorite child and didn't no, she get along? No, my of dad and mom, uh, my dad and mom uh, divided their responsibilities. My dad was with my brother and my mom was with me. Okay. One up at the balcony, Priyanka's balcony favorite balcony. Balcony, how can we This huh? girl in the pink. The girl in the orange. Hi Priyanka, I'm, I'm literally shivering. Don't, don't, don't. Me too. I'm very nervous. <laughs> you know, I'm um, seeing you. I'm watching you live second time. We where, met where at Gold be? Gym, Mumbai. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Just, uh, you know, yeah. Uh, my question is actually I don't have any question. <laughs> I just wanted to ask you. All right. You. Thank you very much. One, 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 one. All right. All right. Thank Man you. in the black. <laughs> right here. My. Hello. 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 Yeah. Priyanka, ma'am. My name is Arjun Sharma. Zor se, zor se, zor se. Ma'am, my name is Arjun Sharma. Rajat Sharma. Arjun Sharma. Arjun Sharma. Zor se bolen. I am from Bhopal. I am so nervous talking to you. Ma'am, I am one of your biggest, biggest fan. Ma'am, I am sitting around here from 8 a.m. just to see you. Thank you. Ma'am, just a humble request, ma'am. Can I have a pic with you, ma'am? Please, ma'am. Okay, and people, please. if you're going to make and requests big, for photographs, and autographs, and pictures, and proclaim your love, that's not a question. Just a okay, you want to ask her, will you marry me? That's the question. You can ask her. <laughs> ma'am, I'm just having a pic, ma'am. I'm so, trying so hard, ma'am. Green t-shirt in the far corner. You. If you are not following the rules, please sit down. You are Mike over there. Hi, Priyanka. My name is Deviru Khanna and what's your phone number? <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Serious question now. Serious question now. Wouldn't you want to know? Hmm. <laughs> Serious question now. Uh, Bollywood is a tough place. So, are you manipulative or just straight away honest? What's your motto uh, so far? Um, honesty is the best policy somebody had said very wisely. And I think it's important to be very honest, but everybody doesn't need to know everything. Sometimes it's more important to keep your mouth shut, which I do very often. Okay, we're going to take a question far back. I want to give it to that girl in the blue pants. The girl in the blue pants with... Mike, Mike. The orange badge. So while they're getting the mic to her, you know, you've done a great job of bonding in Bollywood. Um, what is it that's taken you so far without Godfathers? You've networked very well. All these individuals out here are going to go out in the big bad world and they need to network. How do you get into the good books of people like Shah Rukh Khan? How do you do that? I think you develop a relationship based on honesty and trust. And uh, whether it is... He's somebody I've been a huge fan of. I, I'm, I mean, he's my favorite actor. He always has been. Um, Failure is not an option was his quote, by the way. Uh, yeah. It was, uh, it, it, he's somebody I, I have idealized all my life. And you build a friendship, you build a relationship based on trust. The one thing I will tell all of you is when you go out there in the world to network, you go out there to go ahead. As soon as you suck up to people, they can see it. Don't do that. Don't reduce yourself to having to praise people to be in their good books. You are amazing yourself. As soon as you believe that, your confidence will sell you. Uh, Girl in the blue. Hi Priyanka, I'm a really big fan of you. Hi. I love Can you your hold speech. the mic closer please? Yeah. I loved your speech today. You're so inspiring, you're so lively. Thank you. I want to ask you, what's the one thing you still do in your life, which you used to do back when you were not famous? Everything. <laughs> At least one thing, one hobby, one thing you really do in um, I wake up in the morning and eat my breakfast and my dinner with my parents whenever I'm in Bombay. I, um, whenever I come back home, I jump into my parents' bed. Me, my brother, my mom and dad, we sit down and watch movie, like TV together for at least an hour or so before I go to sleep. I go watch movies in theaters with my friends. I uh, go out for dinners. I mean, I pretty much do everything that I used to. I'm, I, I live a very normal life. So Priyanka, I read recently in a newspaper that you earn 4 crores per movie. What do you spend it on? I don't spend. It's sitting in a bank? I'm a big miser. 
I don't spend. For me, I feel like, you know, I've worked so hard to achieve this money. अभी मैं कैसे खर्चे कर दूँ? I don't even buy clothes. I don't do anything. Um, clothes from Masaba. <laughs> See, Masaba gave me this outfit. I'll get back to you after this. Huh? <laughs> okay, uh, gentleman here with the camera. This one. This one. Uh, uh, Hello. Uh, Hi. Can meet. Uh, a really big fan of yours thank you uh, i want to ask you just tell us about the worst and the best part of your uh, yours in this bollywood industry um the best part of my industry has been the support that i have always got endlessly from people like you people who watch my movies my fans from you know well wishers i don't think he, i would have had the ability to stand up in front of so many people if i didn't have that support The worst was unnecessary, stupid, manipulative, bloody media who make up stories because they don't have the ability to do journalism. Competitors, competitors, not the India Today group. We don't do that. I, 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 I don't mean India Today group. <laughs> They've actually been very good about it. One of the few. Okay, girl in the blue. Priyanka, hi. Biggest fan of yours. Thank I you. Adore you. Thank you. And uh, since I have to ask a question, I really wanted to come and hug you, but then I'm sure she won't allow me. Did you see the eyes? What <laughs> expression? <laughs> just putting it as a question. Could you please just blow a kiss at us? For both of you? Yeah, please. Catch it. Thank you so much. Thank you so okay, much. Okay, we're going up. Girl in the black. I'm in dark purple. Sorry, I can't see it. Well. <laughs> okay, hi Priyanka. My name is Ritika, and I'm from Ambit. I'm studying in Delhi in Pearl Academy of Fashion. Hi. Oh, we love you. Lots of people from Pearl, I can see. Yeah. Okay, so my question to you is: uh, being from a middle-class family and the eldest in the family, of course, in the kids. So, didn't you feel a responsibility that whatever your parents are doing for you, they sent you to abroad? Of course, the money is being spent. So, didn't you have this thing in your mind that somewhere or the other, before you get married or anything, you need to repay them back? So, you said, जो मन में आता है वो करो. तुम जितना कर सकते हो and everything. But a little, a token of love, कि मैं कुछ seriously करूँ and I should give them back. Was it there in Tell your mind? Tell me something. Do you think any one of you? If you take money 50% every month and give it to your parents they'll be happy with it is that what they want The one thing that your parents want is to feel proud of you and they'll feel proud of you if you're successful yeah. you'll be successful if you do what you love so do what you love not giving them directly but doing no follow on questions please no no not giving them directly but doing guys i can't yeah, hear no, please questions please gentlemen here with the glasses hi prenja हो सके तो मुझे भूल जाना यार आयो अरे किसकी बात कर रहे थे मैं तो भूल गई मैं विक्रम <laughs> हाँ बोलिए आप कैसी हैं मैं ठीक हूँ आपका सवाल खत्म हुआ नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन लगभग प्रिंसिपल मैम से मैंने बीस बार शिकायत की तब आपसे बात करने का मौका मिला ये कहेंगे मैं अभी क्या करूँ वैल्यूबल होना थोड़ा तो वक्त देना पड़ेगा थैंक यू ओके Priyanka all your successes have been because you are a fantastic learner so i can't think of a better person to launch our online portal for learning which is going to bring online courses for everybody available on the net uh i'm going to test your acting skills now you have to pretend there's a big giant red button in front of you and you're going to press it and the online portal is going to come alive so there's your button please go ahead Right, I'm pressing this button. Now huh? you guys can see this red button here. You can see it, right? All right, all right. One, two, three. Group presents LearnToday.in, a unique online learning initiative to help young people like you realize their dreams. LearnToday brings to you a selection of exciting courses with easy-to-use, high-quality, 
bite-sized video tutorials by experts. Along with that, as a part of the online course are the topic-specific handouts, module test, a chance to do a live chat with experts and an option to enroll in the workshop. After all, in today's world, a degree no longer guarantees you a job. What you need is to have practical, hands-on training to excel at what you do. And at the end of each course, you not only have a better chance at your dream job, but also are equipped with a certification from the best in the industry and the India Today group. At Learn Today, you can learn at your own pace, anywhere, anytime. Don't lose out on this opportunity and ask yourself, what would you like to learn today? Inspired by Priyanka, she has achieved everything she has from the age of 17 because she was willing to learn. So I hope you're going to take that away with you. May I please request on stage Mr. Arun Puri to give away the token of thanks, please. Actually, the token of appreciation is going to be handed over by... Ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for Priyanka Chopra. And Delhi, I really love you back. Thank you. Thank you for being such a wonderful audience and always remember it's okay to be flawed. It's okay not to be perfect. From one Desi girl to all the Desi boys and girls there. <laughs> Thank you Priyanka. Thank you. Thank you, Priyanka. Thank you, Mr. Puri.